different dragon draw a penguin. Yeah, we hope you're gonna follow along. It's gonna be a really cute penguin, all dressed up for winter in a nice coat. Yeah. <laughs> you need your drawing supplies. We're gonna use markers. You also need some paper. Yeah, and what else? Something to color with. Yeah, something to color with. You don't have to use markers. You can use whatever you have at home or in the classroom. All right, you ready to start? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's first draw our penguin's beak. We're gonna draw it in the middle of our paper. We're gonna draw the letter V right here in the middle of our paper. So maybe right about here. Yeah, and then we're gonna draw the top of the beak. Yes, and then we're gonna draw the eyes. I'm gonna draw a big circle over here on the left and the same size circle on the right. Oh, I love how big your eyes are. Then we're gonna draw smaller circles in the top left of each eye to make the eyes look shiny and also friendly. Yeah. <laughs> then we're gonna color in the big circle, but leave that little circle white. That part we sped up, so remember to pause the video if you need extra time. Okay, now we need to draw our little penguin's warm winter coat. Let's start right here and actually draw this scarf. We're gonna draw a curve right underneath the eyes and also the beak. It looks like a smile almost. <laughs> and then we're gonna draw the, the big puffy coat. So let's draw, this part's a little tricky. Watch me do this first and then you can do yours. I'm gonna draw bumps that connect here and oh, we could also draw, let's draw two bumps on each side. Now it looks like cute little cheeks on each side, huh? Yes, and then one on the other side. And then we're gonna follow all the way around with more bumps. So yes, draw them on the inside. And then watch this, we're gonna go over our little penguin's forehead and then come down over here and connect to the other little, <laughs> You did it. That was really tricky and you did awesome. And it's okay that our two drawings look a little different. They're both turning out awesome. And it's okay if your drawings look different too because the most important thing is to have fun and practice. Yes, remember to have fun and practice. Okay, let's keep going. Yeah. Now we're gonna draw the same bumpy line, but watch, let's draw one bump that comes out a little further here. And then we can do that same little bump over here on the other side. Oh yeah, you added another little one. I'm gonna add another little one too. Now this next part's gonna be a little tricky just like this first one, but watch me first and then you do yours. I'm gonna go all the way around like this and some of the bumps can be big and some of them small until we get all the way Oh, <laughs> now, now doesn't it look like our penguin is nice and cozy? Yeah. You could draw those, yeah, like a cloud. There you go, until you get over to the other side. It also looks like our penguin has curly hair. Yeah. <laughs> Now let's draw the rest of our hat, our winter hat. We're gonna draw a curve that comes over the top, almost like a rainbow line. <laughs> That's awesome. And then let's draw a pom-pom, a little one, on top of our little hat. Yes, all right. Now we need to draw the body. And also, let's add the bottom of this scarf. <laughs> and then we're gonna draw the body. So let's draw, we're gonna draw a coat on our penguin. So we're gonna draw two short lines that come down, one from here down to there, and then we could do another one that comes down that matches. And then let's draw the bottom of the coat coming across to the other side and connecting. Oh, and then we can also draw a line down. This is where our coat buttons. So let's add, I'm gonna add two buttons. And we could also draw, oh, let's draw a little pocket. We could draw a line. And then let's turn it into, yes, a square, or you could draw a U-shape underneath. Oh, and let's draw the end of this scarf. Let's draw two lines coming down on this side. And then we can connect them. And then let's draw the little lines inside for detail on the end of the scarf. Now let's draw the bottom of our penguin coming out from underneath the coat. We're just gonna draw it barely coming down, yeah. So the coat covers most of our penguin's body. Then let's draw our penguin's little feet. We're gonna draw two lines coming out. Oh, like how small you're drawing your feet. Oh, I wish I drew my feet that small. And then we're gonna draw a little curve to connect them. And then let's draw the little feet over here on this side. And then we could draw two curves connecting. Yeah, all right, what's our penguin missing? It's arms. Yeah, arms or wings. <laughs> we're, we're gonna draw arms though, because our penguin is wearing a coat. So let's draw a diagonal line coming out. And then let's draw it connecting back in. And let's repeat that same shape over here. 
So we can come out the same and then back in the same. And then let's draw a puffy part to the coat at the end of the sleeve and the same on the other sleeve. And then let's add gloves or mittens. I'm gonna draw the letter U for the mitten on one arm and the other arm. We did it! We finished drawing our penguins dressed up for winter, except we're not completely done. Still need to color it. Yes, my favorite! We are gonna fast forward this part, so remember to pause the video, take extra time to color your drawings. You ready to speed things up? Yeah. We did it! We finished drawing and coloring our cute little penguins dressed up for winter. I especially love yours. It's my favorite. Thank you. I like yours too. Oh, thanks. Now you guys can pause the video right now to match our same coloring or... You can color it any way you want. Yeah, you can change the colors or even add more things in the background. You could also add extra details. You could add maybe more penguins or... Or lots of snowballs. Oh, you could draw lots of snowballs. That could be our penguin's name. Snowball. Oh, yeah. Snowball. <laughs> Snowball. <laughs> you could also name your penguins anything you want, but I really like Snowball. We should draw Snowball all the time. Maybe in the summertime we should draw a snowball. Maybe at the beach. Where, where else could we draw a snowball? In a rocket ship. <laughs> we could draw a snowball going to space. That would be awesome. We hope you have fun drawing Snowball with us. We do. We hope you had a lot of fun. And we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.